Hello everybody, we're live here from Roots Tech with Daniel Horowitz from MyHeritage and he's got some exciting new stuff going on over at MyHeritage that um, he's going to tell yeah. us about because we decided to go ahead and do this live because it is that urgent of news. So Definitely. That tell us is, about it. That is what we do, Connie, and thank you very much for having me here. Uh, and yes, as you say, we are live in Roots Tech and we just finish spelling the beans. Yeah. Gilad, Gilad, our own CEO, just had this lecture. And let's start with today, this morning. We started on the keynote and we had Iron Godfrey announcing old news. Now... Okay, he's talking about old news newspapers. That's right. Old news is probably not good news, right? But for us, genealogists is the oh, yeah. best. This is what we want. Yeah. So what my heritage did is we created a separate website only to deal with newspapers. At the moment, we have 20 million pages over there, not only from the United States, but also from the Netherlands, from Germany, from other countries, the UK, Canada, and more coming up. I already heard France is one of the next ones in the list. So if you have ancestors coming from any of those countries, you have to try it. And this is a different business model. So you can go right now, it's open right for you, oldnews.com, and you will be able to register for a seven day free trial separate from your MyHeritage account. So you don't need to be a MyHeritage user. You can just be an old newspaper user and pay a very reduced price because you don't need the other. Now, I know that all the people who are a MyHeritage user is saying, okay, but what with us? Well, with you, we came up with a new level of membership up till just a few hours ago, the best plan that you could get was complete. And that gave you everything. And you know, people are Just mad to be at clear, me. we're talking about my heritage. My heritage, yes. yes. Okay. So it will give you the matches, it will give you the family tree, it will give you the support, it will give you all the features. And people are mad at me because yesterday they were asking me. And I said, yes, complete is the most that you need that's all you could talk about <laughs> today everything changed that's why we're here today we're announcing omni and omni is really everything and when we say everything it means everything it means spell omni just so everybody all o -M -N -I? O -M -N -I. yeah okay so it's everything on my heritage it's everything in all news but it's even more than that it's a premium subscription in Genie. Oh. It's a subscription to Legacy Family Tree webinars. Nice. It is really everything that you need. See, they're saying great information. Of course. <laughs> and not only that, but you know that we have this app called Reimagine, where we had a very special technology to scan multiple pictures with artificial intelligence and being able to do that. Well, guess what? what? We decide to add that to our mobile app because a lot of people are already having the MyHeritage app out there and are using that app. So we're bringing that technology there and it will be included in Omni. Okay? okay. Now, yes, we still need to figure out if you already have a complete and you want an Omni, how do you do it? We're all putting all that information on the website, but we're very excited to be able to bring you millions of page, pages of newspapers from all over the world. Now, let me ask you, how, is there a percentage of these that are unique that they're not going to find on any of the other newspaper repositories? Well, Connie, I, I'm going to tell the truth here, yeah. okay, because you had early access to that. Yes. And I do know that other My Heritage friends had early access to that. I can tell you, and I'm pretty sure that she's not going to be mad at me, Maureen Taylor, uh -huh. also a MyHeritage friend, right. found over there newspapers from her area, 
but she didn't find any place else. And Maureen okay. is a long time right. genealogist. Right. Okay. So yes, we do have exclusive newspapers going from Europe and from the United States. Nice. And Gilad promised another hundred million pages by the end of the year. And you know what happened when Gilad promised, right? Well, make sure that you tell everybody we, who Gilad we is. We just need to work harder. <laughs> Gilad is the CEO of my heritage. Yes. He is the head of the company. And as I said, he was just doing a lecture here in Rootstech. It's the only conference that he attends and he loves to have this interaction with the public. He also announced a partnership that my heritage is doing with Family Tree DNA. Wow, okay. that's going to be fantastic so, resources. Definitely. So if you have your DNA in your tree, in family tree DNA, okay, you will be able to use my heritage and the other way around. And yes, I'm seeing here some users of my heritage from a long time ago, and we always bring you new stuff. More than that, more with the new stuff on the DNA, even Gilad said. You know, the ethnicity estimation hmm, wasn't that good. Yeah. Well, he just announced that the research team is working hard to release in the summer the ethnicity estimations 2.0. Nice. And this is more ethnicities, more accuracy, and what we are offering all of you here in Rootstech but not only here, also for you there at home, until Sunday, if you have done a DNA test. This is a deal, with listen up. any <laughs> other companies, okay? That's good. I'm here to save you money. You don't need to buy a MyHeritage DNA kit. Just take whatever data your other company gave you and upload to MyHeritage. If you upload your DNA this weekend, you will have all the features free forever. So this is the time. If you have not uploaded to MyHeritage, go to the website or whatever you have, your other DNA, download the data, upload it to MyHeritage. And I know that a lot of people are gonna ask, why? Because the pool of people that MyHeritage has is different. It may not be bigger, but it's more European. It says wow. Oh, yeah. <laughs> it it's is a wow. definitely a wow. Yeah. Because it's more European, it's more the rest of the world, and it's free. So why not doing it? Right. But, now, let me back up a second. Yes. We upload to MyHeritage, and I want to think you said earlier that they would have access. Maybe I missed it while you were talking. Go ahead. Because I was reading chats. <laughs> but... Uh, Access to the DNA tools. Yes. For how long? Forever. For free? For free forever. It's what wow. some people like to say grandfather dad. Okay, yeah. that's the term that we're using. I still don't understand why. But yes, if you upload new DNA kits this weekend. Wonderful. Free wow, what? Forever. <laughs> yes. Now I do have one thing to ask you, please, 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 please. When you're bringing a DNA to my heritage, please bring also a copy of your family tree. And you can also upload JetComs for free without any problem. Let me give you a secret. That's truly you... amazing. I'll be setting it up. <laughs> oh, yes. Now, let's say you have a free account because we all like free, right? So you have a free account, you upload your DNA, you have everything for free over there, and then you upload your family tree. Us, we're talking about 8,000 people in my family tree at least. They will all go up. The family tree is gonna be there and you're gonna get matches with records and with other family trees. And you still don't need to pay, okay? until you see if the match is really what you're looking for, if this is convenient for you, then you pay. But give it a try for free. Now, so will they have access to the auto cluster tools, the chromosome browser? Chromosome browser, one to wow. many, auto cluster. 
the ethnicity report, the DNA matches, the triangulated matches, because it's not only that I match somebody, but if that somebody matches my man, for example, which I also match, I can guarantee you this person is coming from my maternal side. I saw a comment okay? that said uh, that would be huge for helping break down brick walls. So true. That's the idea. The idea of my heritage is to help you find your relatives, advance your research, and be better genealogists. I don't know how you guys afford to do that. And by the way, this is not sponsored by my heritage, you guys. I just thought this was so amazing. I had to wrangle uh, Daniel here to sit down for a minute, and we decided to do it. Uh, love all the features at my heritage. Yes, agreed. Now I have one more for you, Connie. A more? <laughs> There's more? I, I was not coming here just for that. <laughs> Recently, we did kind of a silent release and it's the My Heritage Wiki. Oh, yeah. I don't know if you know about it. I don't know if you have heard about it. My Heritage decided to build a free wiki where we're putting information over there, general information about genealogy. If you're researching a specific area of the world, if you would like to know more about how to do your DNA or what to do with your DNA matches, like regular genealogy not related to my heritage if you go to myheritage myheritage.com slash wiki you will be able to find all the information over there you can register we will keep you updated for that but if not just enjoy those articles enjoy that information and more and more are going to be published over there fantastic wow there's some really, you guys are kicking butt. I don't know how you can afford to do it, but. Uh, we I, work hard for that. I, I, you know what? I'm speechless because I was had all these questions in my mind and you answered them before I even got a chance to ask no. them. <laughs> that was an easy interview. I, I uh, am just really excited. See, I'm seeing excited. some wows and thank yous. Yes, I'm really excited to be here in Rootstech. I'm really excited to be here with you. And I'm really excited to be able to bring all those features to everybody out there. Fantastic. I don't think there's anything else I have to share no? unless you do. Okay, no, I think that's all. Oh, you know what? No, I'm sorry. I have more. <laughs> you have more. But wait, there's more. Yes. Uh, yeah, this looks like a commercial for yeah, those. Right. That you <laughs> because we try to innovate with technology mm -hmm. and we're always trying new things. But we're also keep an eye on what we did in the past. Mm -hmm. We have on the family tree or one of the views is the profile page. And that page was already getting old and a little bit useless. So we decided also to right. revamp that page. And now it has more information. That was just released this it morning. It is better. Wasn't it? That was yesterday. Oh, yeah, I'm getting days. my days mixed up. Oh, of course. It's Roots Tech. It's crazy. <laughs> Once we are in the plane, <laughs> then we realize, okay, this is over. But until then, we don't know what date is it. <laughs> I know, right? So the profile page not only allows you to see all the information about the person, it has a very cool map pinpointing all the places where you have facts. Mm -hmm. And guess what's happened when you're missing information? We're gonna give you hints. So we're gonna tell you that you may have the birth year, but we find the record that will give you the day and the month. Or go. we have another family tree that may add more information for another relative. Yeah. So you will get hints just by clicking over there, you will be able to see them, accept them, and very soon, and this is a scoop, very soon you will be able to extract that information and doing all from that profile page. Nice. So it's going to be the one stop to do genealogy. Now, don't blame us <laughs> if you still stay till 4 o'clock in the morning just clicking on those hints and going over those people and those profile pages. Okay? Nicely done. And we have a lot more coming up. You just need to keep an eye on my heritage. And the best way to do that is blog.myheritage.com. 
I'm pretty sure you're gonna put all those URLs down here in the description at some point. But yes, keep an eye on us because nobody's gonna stop us. Yeah, keep an eye on Genealogy TV too. <laughs> That's sure what I'm saying. Subscribe. Right here. Yes. Again, Connie, we're here for the scoops. There we go. See? I Excellent. appreciate it. Excellent. Uh, I saw somebody else say happy dance too in the comments. Oh, so yes. thanks for all the comments. It's always fun to do lives. Thank you so much, Daniel. With pleasure. Thank I you for inviting it. me. Thank you for being here and enjoy. All right. Thank you. We're gonna we're gonna shut it down now if we can figure out how to do it. <laughs> All right. Let's see. One of these buttons does that. I don't know. We'll figure it out. Oh, no! look, the media. No, not that button. Not that button. Let's try that button. Yeah. All right. Bye.